Kathy um, with a C, Mabbutt, M-A-B-B-U-T-T. -T. And I'm going to ask you, how, how long have you been doing this for? Um, I've been doing it for 16 years, I, and I just got reelected for another four. So what is it that, or I guess, when did you get the call on Sunday? I got the call just a few minutes after noon that there were four homicides, but I didn't go to the scene um, because of law enforcement doing their investigation first, so I didn't actually go to the scene until about 5 or 5.30. Can you walk us through, like for our viewers, kind of the process between, like, between, between when police show up and then you guys getting the bodies and doing your examinations? Sure. Um, well, law enforcement goes through and um, looks for any evidence, um, takes videos and pictures of everything in there, and um, they'll start talking with people. So I don't really need to be there for that. I just, they can't move the bodies. I mean, the bodies have to stay um, as they were until the coroner gets there. So that's, those are really what, that's what my job is. To and look at the bodies. As a coroner, do you guys do um, the autopsies and all that? No, we um, s some do if they're an actual medical examiner, but we have forensic pathologists and we contract with Spokane to do that. So, in your experience, what is it that you saw when you showed up? Um, well, there was a lot of blood. It was, yeah, it was. It was a very sad scene with four. Uh, murdered college students. Um, you're ruling all four deaths homicides? Yes. Okay. And um, can you give us a manner of death? Yeah. Um, I believe that the press release was that they were from a um, sharp object. Mm -hmm. So So stabbing. Yeah, I we'll know more after the autopsies tomorrow. Okay. And do you believe this could be a no, there are four homicides. Four homicides. Okay. Um, and when it comes to doing the investigation post autopsy, that falls on you, correct? Yes. It's um, my job to determine the manner and mechanism of death. Um, and then I know with toxicology results, there can often be, this is Washington, a delay. So do you have any idea how long it could take if this were relevant to get any type of results back on that? Well, the toxicology reports, right, they usually take four to six weeks, sometimes longer. Um, but I, they might, um, I don't think they're going to be relevant in the actual manner or cause of death. And do we know how long between the time of death and when police found them? Talking. No, I don't. I don't know for sure. Do we like? Do we have like any like? Could it have been hours? Could it have been a day? Was it maybe close? Like, is there any sort of like time frame there? Um, not that, not that I'm aware of. Okay. Um, you said the scene was really difficult. I mean, is this something you've had to deal with before in Las Vegas? Um, since I've been coroner, there have been. Um, at least two other multiple homicide scenes that I've been involved in, so. Would you say this is probably the most gruesome? No, it's, it's hard to just single it out. It's the only one I've been to where there have been four people at one scene. There have been other, the other ones have had multiple scenes. Um, and was anybody else injured, like, uh, not that I'm aware of, but I wouldn't necessarily be notified either. Okay. I didn't know if that was like, because the injuries could be similar and it would matter to you. Oh, but right. No. Okay. Were the deceased all in close proximity to each other or were they in different rooms? Um, I don't know that I can discuss that. That was really one of my next questions too, so. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Um, will we be able to get a copy of your report once it's concluded? I'm sure it'll be. Oh, right. sure. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Just call. Yes. Okay. Yep. Thank you. Do you know yeah. what the time frame for that would be? Um, it just depends on how relevant the toxicology report is. But. Oh, okay. Okay. So, so it, could, it would like the four to six weeks. So it okay. could be. Yeah. yeah.
You're welcome. Yeah. yeah. We appreciate it. Sure. Yeah.